a beautiful day to do so. Oh, huh? what a beautiful day yeah. after yesterday in comparison, especially mm -hmm. yeah. sunshine, oh, low yeah. humidity. Oh, got to love it. <laughs> yes, some beautiful conditions as we get a live look right now at Center City, Philadelphia. Sunshine and just some fair weather cumulus clouds and temperatures that are certainly warmer than where we were at this time yesterday. We're at 77 degrees right now. That west wind up around 10 miles per hour. Have a little bit of a heat index right there, feeling more like 78 degrees. But this scene was barren yesterday and looked much, much different. But check this out. Beautiful conditions right now on Rehoboth Beach. People out on the sand, people out on the boards, a lot of sunshine in the scene. A nice looking beach day and storm scan three confirming all of this sunshine, especially across South Jersey and down the shore. Seeing some of those fair weather cumulus clouds along I-95 and points to the north and west, but altogether a very nice Wednesday and temperatures right now in the 70s. 77 degrees in Trenton. We're at 76 in Allentown, 75 degrees in Atlantic City, 78 in Millville. And yeah, over the last 24 hours, our temperatures are up big time on the order of about 15 degrees in Trenton. We're up 12 degrees from this time yesterday in Philadelphia. That's because yesterday, of course, we had the clouds, we had the rain, and then we had that easterly wind off the Atlantic today. West wind bringing in some of that drier air, but hopefully with that west wind down the shore, you're not dealing with any of those green flies right now. But overnight tonight, mostly clear and mild, only falling back to 67 degrees. And as we head into the day tomorrow, briefly warming things up, bringing back that summer like heat up to 85 degrees, actually above average tomorrow. We'll see mostly sunny conditions, few clouds into the afternoon. We could see a pop up late day shower or thunderstorm. We do have a new tropical system to talk about. Tropical storm Irma right now. It has formed by the Cape Verde Islands that is just off the west coast, west coast of Africa. So well out into the Atlantic at this point, but Cape Verde style storms typically become some of the strongest and long lived storms of the season. Wind speed it's right now already at 60 miles per hour, so a, tro a strong tropical storm. It will strengthen to a hurricane over really as we head into the day tomorrow. A cat two as we head into the upcoming weekend will continue to move westbound, so still a long ways off. But because of the nature of the storm, it's something we're going to have to keep a close eye on in the long range. But in the short range down the shore, looking pretty good tomorrow. Some sunshine watching out for that chance of a late day shower or thunderstorm on the sand. Temperatures generally in the low 80s. Water temperature 72. Still watch out though for that elevated risk of rip currents. Future weather showing us as we head into the evening hours, nice and quiet. Same case into the overnight period through the day tomorrow. Seeing some clouds increasing in the afternoon. We'll see a draw, uh, excuse me, back to our cold front dropping in for the second half of the day that could generate an isolated shower or a thunderstorm as we head into the late afternoon and evening hours. We made in America festival. It's just around the corner uh, Saturday. We will see some periods of a cool rain moisture enhanced by Harvey 72 degrees as we head into Sunday though. Big time improvement, a shower early in the morning, then sunshine breaking out, breezy conditions, a warmer high temperature at 80 degrees. And Labor Day is looking like the best day of that holiday weekend on Monday. Sunshine up to 82 degrees as we look ahead towards, we'll back things up. Look at Friday, and that's the start of September. Cool and crisp, 70 degrees. So really something for everyone in the seven-day forecast.